Hi, and welcome to my very first Illustrate With Me. I'm so happy to have you here and cannot wait to get creative with you all. I thought that I could use my small space on the internet to share my illustrations and create a community where others can also spark their imagination too. So this is a design that I did yesterday after work. I wanted to create more adorable everyday objects in my style and give myself an objective to make the most of my time at home. It is so easy to just put your feet up and binge watch YouTube. So let's get stuck in. This right here is Maxine. She is my cat and yeah, she loves to stop my productivity and get in the way constantly. So if anybody else has cats like this, you will know, you understand. The software that I'm using is Adobe Illustrator which creates vector files. These vector files are able to be resized with no problems whatsoever. I really enjoy creating illustrations within this software as I build up layers of basic shapes that overlap one another to create a final outcome. As you can see, I am creating basic shapes using the pen tool. I will then position these different layers in front or behind of each other so that I can create a sense of depth. I will then go in to add some highlights and shadows, but not too many as I like my work to be imperfect and slightly off. When the time is right, I will then add a super cute face to my design to make it come to life and I absolutely adore them. Just another quick note that I'm very sorry if I'm speaking really fast in some sections. This is because I have to keep reminding myself to speak slowly otherwise you probably will not understand me. For the final touch, I am just copying and pasting the illustration that I will be able to create a path offset. So this is my final illustration. I love to keep them simple, clean and very cute. I am now moving on to another object. I thought that I was only going to do the one, but it does get a little addictive sometimes. So the original idea was to create a milkshake, but I have somehow created a cute boba tea cutie instead. was the same method for this illustration as well but then towards the end I just decided to add a few more little boba floaties um, just to give it a bit more detail as well and that's pretty much it. As you can see Maxine has made another appearance. She just loves to sit on the desk with me whilst I'm getting creative and she loves a good snooze.
I really hope that you enjoyed my very first Illustrate with me. I know that I did and it definitely gives me even more motivation. If you are new to my channel, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to see more videos. On my channel, my previous videos are mainly vlogs, but I will be making more design related videos too, featuring Maxine, of course. So a huge thank you for watching and I can't wait to see you all again soon.